this all about. This is going to be awesome. He's Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Friday Night down. SmackDown as we're kicking things off with the WWE Champion, the Scottish Warrior, Drew McIntyre. And it's always great to see Drew McIntyre in the building, and he is excited. And it looks like Drew McIntyre has something on his mind and something he wants to get off his chest as we kick things off here on SmackDown. Loud and proud. A and then we're just two weeks away from WWE Extreme Rules. On the one night a year, WWE goes extreme. And Drew McIntyre seems livid over the fact that he has not discovered his opponent the for the WWE Championship at Extreme well, Rules. Okay. Drew McIntyre says he is ready to give anybody an opportunity at the WWE Championship. If anybody's willing to step up and take their shot. Confidence is good. Eric Tonight is their night. Oh, wait a minute. A Look who it is. The belief is strong. Mr. Money in the here? Bank, the great liberator, Sami Zayn. He really loves that mic. You know this guy came prepared. This could honestly Sami Zayn is in a very great Let's mood after winning the money in the bank ladder matchup. As he's interrupting the WWE champion Drew McIntyre. That's the kind of stuff that will drive a superstar a little crazy. Gotta respect that. Sami Zayn getting all up in the face of Drew McIntyre. And Sami Zayn says he is not out here to challenge Drew McIntyre at Extreme Rules for his Universal Championship. He said, I'll be silly. Not making any friends, but not He's really simply out here to give either. Drew McIntyre a warning a on the future to become as Sami Zayn holds possession of the Money in the Bank briefcase and can cash in at any time, anywhere. A lot of anger behind those words, guys. Okay. Sami Zayn said, maybe tonight, uh -oh. maybe Sammy at Extreme Rules, but somewhere down the line, he is going to cash well in played. his Money in the Bank briefcase and become a WWE champion. And Drew McIntyre telling Sami Zayn that he doesn't have the balls to cash in on somebody like him. Got to respect that. Well, the table is set. Sami Zayn telling Drew McIntyre, mark his words. He will cash the in his strong. Money in the Bank briefcase on him. These superstars, that's for sure. And Drew McIntyre telling Sami Zayn he's lucky that he is booked for a match tonight against King Corbin. If nonetheless, Drew McIntyre will love to switch and have it be him and Sami Zayn right now and kick the hell out of Sami Zayn. An angry reaction from an angry superstar. Poking the bear. And Sami Zayn says he's not going to give Drew McIntyre the satisfaction well, and give him okay. a matchup here tonight. Not even a fight. One of the most popular superstars in the WWE. No Sami Zayn doesn't want to risk an injury and have perhaps forfeit his Money in the Bank briefcase. Drew McIntyre calling Sami Zayn a coward. 
Coming off a little cocky right there. Could be dangerous. Tied up nicely. Drew McIntyre telling Sami Zayn he looks forward to him cashing in his money in the bank briefcase just so he can kick Claymore, kick his damn head off. Strong words from the WWE Championship Drew McIntyre to Mr. Money in the Bank. Sami Zayn came out here to lay down a warning to Drew McIntyre, the WWE Champion. And the Scottish psychopath returned with one of his own. If Sami Zayn ever tries to cash in, his money in the bank briefcase in Drew McIntyre's presence, he's gonna receive a Claymore kick to the face, courtesy of the WWE Champion, Drew McIntyre. But we're up next is our first match up here on Friday Night SmackDown, as we will see the New Day taking on the Usos, two teams brewing out an opportunity for the SmackDown Tag Team Championships. Both teams are number one contenders for the Tag Team Championships, but who's gonna earn that opportunity here tonight? As we see the New Day come close to becoming Tag Team Championships once again in the, in the past. But they haven't fallen out so much. But the New Day seem to have the odds when going up against the Usos. Can tonight be their night once again? Or will the Usos find a way to prevail over the New Day here tonight? And look forward to taking down heavy machinery for those SmackDown Tag Team Championships. As we get to find that out right now. Welcome to the Uso Penitentiary. The cousins the of the tribal is. chief Roman Reigns. Four, we saw come out here last week and declare himself number one contender for the WWE Championship. Oh, wait a minute. The New Day may have something to prove here tonight. It looks like we're going to get a fight all oh, right here tonight on top of the stage. Both teams all oh, do not like each other. We know the history between the New Day and the Usos. He just run on his partner. Oh, and a super kick right to the midsection. And another one with an uppercut. And now they're far showing their focus on to Xavier Woods. Oh, I can't see anything. So can the crowd. Oh. Woods being targeted by both members of the Usos. And now, wait a minute. Oh, Xavier Woods. Luck catching up to him there. Now, Kofi Kingston being tossed inside of the ring. And I guess this matchup is officially underway. Oh, and here we go. These two teams do not like each other, but the respect is there. You still have battles in Hell in a Cell matches. Oh, at WrestleMania and on a Hell in a Cell pit review ladder matches. And no disqualification today. tag team matches. These two teams have been to war and back. Well, I should say Helen back. Oh, tag in. with one another. Here's the tag in Xavier Woods. Woods oh, from the second row. There's a pin. And oh, that could have been it. Showed up here tonight for a fight, and that's exactly what we are seeing. I'm looking for a suplex. And oh! Perfectly executed snap suplex there. And look at Xavier Woods filling the things here in this matchup. Now might be a good time to give him what he wants. Xavier Woods making his statement as we speak. Oh, nice counter there. Super kick right to the midsection. Oh my god. And comes right back with a backbreaker. New Day in control. Oh wait, not for long here. Jey Uso, oh, what a Russian leg sweep there. Wiping out Woods. Iris whipping in the corner. Oh, and a boot right to the face by Xavier Woods and an elbow right to the jaw. Terrific counter there and another one. And oh, caught him in midair. Oh, and a Samoa drop. There's the tag in his brother Jimmy. What do you think about superstars who have worked and worked and worked? Oh, misses the super kick. One big shot at the goal. Kofi Kingston is a textbook example. Kofi finally got that shot. Kofi Kingston wants to tag in. History and Kofi's going to get it. The WWE Championship. 
Oh, and a super kick. Oh, and a perfectly executed uppercut. Jimmy Uso in control now. Kick to the midsection. DDT. Kofi Kingston looks stunned by that. Well, it's not dire consequences for Kofi's him, gonna have to try to find his way back in into this matchup. Off the ropes and a forearm right to the face. Oh, Kofi quickly back up to his feet. No selling that move, but oh! Got caught there. The headbutt there. Oh, and a cheap shot right to the face. When Jimmy starts rolling like this, look out below. Now Jay. One in the tag in, and Jimmy, oh, bringing him right into the corner. Here's the tag in by the Usos, working together very well. Uh oh, oh, and that kick, all oh, right to the back of the leg. Right to the back knee there, taking out the knee of Kofi Kingston, who's trying to get a tag in on Xavier Woods, and Woods is going to make the tag in a clothesline. For Kofi Kingston, the weight paid off. Absolutely has to make a tag here. Oh, yeah, float over. DDT. Almost just a little bit further. Come on now. Oh, on the top there. rope now. Give up now. Boom. There's the tag. Jey Uso top Look rope. Jey Uso. Oh, what a fly with a cross body. And here's Jey Uso. Excellent cross body there. Cover one. Xavier and a kick out at one as Xavier Woods in stays in this matchup. You know that. Look, most times I think Xavier Woods and his New Day brethren act like a bunch I'll of I missed that one. But when the bell rings, Woods is all about business. Oh, and a body slam. Get the job done. Xavier Woods finds himself in some trouble. Uh-oh. This is not the time. It's a very to bad place for Xavier Woods to be in. He got the whole locked in. in there. there it is, Tequila play. Sunrise. Tequila Sunrise. Oh, and Xavier Woods being saved by his tag team partner. Comes in off the tag. Kofi Kingston. There's a tag in a Jimmy Uso. Oh, and a diving headbutt. How much longer can these superstars All continue? Woods. On the road. Oh! Face buster there. Good night. Cover. And oh, a kick out. He is able to stay in the matchup somehow. Oh, and a monkey flip. Well, Jimmy Uso isn't shy. Uso's filling it. Oh, and Kofi Kingston makes a cheap shot to the outside. Oh, the New Day outnumbered now. Uh-oh. Shades of the Uncle Rikishi. I mean, Umaga. Backing that up. Oh, and that flying hip attack there. Good night, Woods. There's no way Xavier Woods is going to kick out of this. It Woods no powers out at two. Wow, Xavier Woods, Woods showing some heart. But he powers through despite the beating he's taken all match long. Snapmare takedown. Oh, Woods. Woods get the early looking for the win. Jimmy gets and a the kick out at one. As Jimmy Uso is still in this matchup. And that will not be enough to put away the Usos here tonight. But an Irish whip into the corner. Uh oh, and a new day. There it is, midnight hour. Oh, look, tossing the official out of the outside. How smart is that? Taking the official out of the matchup. Oh, trying to stop the pin. Has no business being in there. Oh. Oh, dodges that one. Kofi caught him. Neck breaker. Oh, Xavier Woods waiting off for the tag. He won't get it there. Off the ropes. Oh, caught him in midair again. Samoa drop. A Samoa drop right there. Jimmy Uso going up high. Top row goes Jimmy Uso. Oh, and the Uso splash. Cover on Kofi. One, two. But no, Kofi Kingston kicks out. Kofi was able to get the shoulder up. A hard shot that was to the face. Oh, what a tag team matchup this has been. 
emotion. As we kick off SmackDown. Oh. Turning it around. Nice Kofi counter there. With the reversal. Oh, Kofi Kingston turning things around. Harakorana. Nice. Excellent Harakorana there. And the two day drop connects there by Kofi. Shoulders down. And the all oh, kick out there. Saw that one coming. Looking stunned. Oh, what a cheap shot. Takes down Xavier Woods. Oh, back with that thing up. Oh, the Uso splash. Right on the outside. You'd have to think a splash. Uso. And oh, another Uso splash. Cover right here. One, two, three. And the Usos pick up the win. Huge victory for the Usos here in this tag team matchup tonight. Here are your winners, Jimmy Uso and Jay Uso. The Uso. And Jay Uso is the one to put this one away for the team. Beautiful sequence of Uso splashes there. One on the outside to Xavier Woods and one on the inside of the ring to Kofi Kingston. Gets the job done. Usos pick up the win here tonight on SmackDown. And that one has to feel good after losing that money in the bank to the tag team champions, Heavy Machinery. But coming up next, we saw what happened to Mustafa Ali last week at the hands of Aleister Black. Think about what can happen to Apollo Crews after Apollo Crews interfered in that matchup. So now Crews looking to get some revenge for not only himself, but his friend Mustafa Ali, after the vicious attack by Alistair Black last week, when he wedged that chair into the throat and stomped away on Mustafa Ali. But up next is No Holds Barred here on Friday Night SmackDown. We're going to see some bloodshed possibly here, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Friday Night SmackDown. Here comes Apollo Crews with revenge on his mind here tonight. It's Apollo! And it's a no holds barred matchup against a dangerous Aleister Black. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Stone Mountain, Georgia. Weighing in at 241 pounds, Apollo Crews! As Apollo Crews makes his way to the ring, all I can think of is that this man is custom built for the WWE. Where's this going? Oh, look at it. Look who's right there with a steel chair in hand. Oh, Alistair Black appearing out of nowhere with a steel chair. The same steel chair he used to take out Mustafa Ali last week. And this no holds barred matchup is underway. And Cruz, oh, must stay on the attack. Must bring the pain and frustration in the fight to Alistair Black. Oh, and a neck breaker right on that steel chair. Total composure, even the most intense situation. We're going to have to see more moves Alistair like that from Apollo Crews if he wants to win here tonight. Here it comes. Oh, he's going to lock in the tequila sunrise. Gonna, 
Going to make Alistair Black pay. Alistair Black has seen a change over the past couple of weeks here on SmackDown. Oh, what a beautiful kick that was. Late caught. But oh, one right to the back of the head. Oh, ducks the kick there. By Apollo Cruz. Off the ropes. Whoa, Black able to oh, float over. DDT. Far striking ability goes. Devastating DDT there by, Black. by Black. Oh, you're absolutely right, Michael. I can't imagine a good strategy to defend against. Now, under the ring now, Alistair Black. Strategy, Saxton. With a kendo stick in hand. <laughs> oh, and using great, that kendo stick as a weapon on Apollo Cruz and damaging the way the official even getting hit. Oh, nobody is oh, safe. Man, look at this. It's like he's got eight arms and feet. I got those it's strikes. Like oh. Arms and feet. There's no holds barred match. Just spills like to the outside. The, outside where things can get the former Universal Champion. Back in from the floor. Oh. Cruz looking to have control of this matchup. And, oh, Very it's a suplex. suplex. Vertical suplex. A wicked suplex. Watch out. And, oh. Swinging neck breaker. He's getting a little battered now. Oh, springboard. No oh, getting out of the way there. Oh, and an elbow right to the face. Oh, and Black fires right back with those ability. strikes. Knee right to the face. Turn out the lights. Apollo. On the outside now, trying to make his way back up to his feet. Oh, Black like he wants to take flight. Wicked oh. Body shot. Oh, missed that time. Oh. Cruz. And Cruz now showing off the power Samoa there. Drop. Oh, that had Samoa drop there, taking out Alistair Black. Oh, fires in a clothesline. Oh, this is no holds barred. Oh, anything goes. Oh, nasty elbows there. Oh, Black turning the tables. Harsh impact. Oh, just two weeks for Extreme Rules matchup. We're getting a taste of Extreme Rules here tonight. Oh, Alistair Black now. Wedging in that steel chair into the corner. Now has the kendo stick in hand. Apollo Crews starting to surface back up to his feet here. Trying to find his wits about himself. It oh, is. a nasty Dude, shot with that kendo that? stick. A dangerous shot. Now back to the outside. Apollo Crews is not a smart athlete here. Don't turn your back on a man with a steel chair in his hand. It looks like a twisted heap. Oh my goodness. I think that was harder than the first time. Alistair Black is not letting up. Whoa, Apollo Crews able to avoid damage. Oh, and that kick right to the face with the steel chair. Apollo Crews is seeing stars. Oh, and another kick right to the back of the head. Oh, that's how you get the chair out of his hand there. Oh, what a shot! Oh, counter in there. Oh, what a shot right to the face. I mean, say to the chest there. Iris whip. Oh, right against the steel chair. Right against that steel chair top rope goes Alistair Black, looking to put this match up away. Moonsault connects. Perfectly executed He's there by the Alistair down. Black. Builders down. And oh, Apollo Crews. Unbelievable. Apollo's guts and determination are the only things giving him a chance right now. And oh. Alistair Black still able to take advantage here of this matchup. Here, especially when there are no count outs. Alistair Black wants another steel chair perhaps we've seen what he's capable of with steel chairs over the past couple of weeks oh my goodness oh all right to the midsection how the hell can you escape these strikes right here oh my goodness look at those shots oh 
Black looking to inflict some damage. He's taking charge. Apollo here. Cruz using the ropes to get him back up to his feet. Here there's no holds bar match. Oh, and the boot sends him right over the top rope. Oh God. What is it gonna take to end this? Look. Oh, and a knee right to the face. And now a brain buster on the outside. Alistair Black certainly showed his vicious side coming into this no holds barred matchup tonight. Oh, Black turning the tables. And now I caught him. Oh, and an insecurity right to the back of the head. Whoa, Black able to and that knee, oh, wipes him out that time. Uh, Alistair Black uh -oh. setting up Black's for a knee. Oh, right to the face. Bicycle, knee strike, good night. Oh, no, we've seen this before. We've seen Alistair Black do this before. This is what happened to Mustafa Ali last week on SmackDown. Now the same thing is going to happen once again to Apollo Crews. No. Oh, Crews got out of the way. Thank God. Thank God Apollo Crews is able to get out of the way. But oh, whoa, wasn't able to get out of the way of those black mask ticks. Cover. One, two, three. And Black picks up the win. What a victory. Luckily, he was able to escape whatever Alistair Black had planned. Alistair Black gets the victory here tonight. Apollo Cruz falls and feeds the Black. I don't think the Dutch destroyer. This was overly finished. Oh, this is about to pick up. what Apollo Crews here tonight. Alistair Black. Oh, no. We all know what Alistair Black has on his mind. The same thing he did to Mustafa Ali last week. He is now going to do to Apollo Crews here tonight on Friday Night SmackDown. No, 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 no. Oh, he does it again. For the second week in a row, Alistair Black wiping out another foe. And this time, he's going to add a little extra damage here to Apollo Crews. And a black mask kick. What the hell has gotten into Alistair Black? And now mocking and laughing in the face of Apollo Crews after such an, a heinous attack. Oh, we're going to need some help out here for Apollo Crews. This new side of Alistair Black is certainly more dangerous than when he first arrived on the scene here in WWE. Uh, but coming up next, we're going to hear from our United States champion, the Celtic warrior Sheamus, as he sees to, op to extend an open challenge to John Cena for his United States championship here tonight. Will the Dr. Thugonomics accept Sheamus' challenge here tonight, or will he back down from the Celtic warrior Sheamus? As we all know, Sheamus assaulted John Cena last week here on SmackDown. Sheamus is toying with John Cena and perhaps wants to put an end to Cena and send him back to Hollywood.
And it's the Celtic Warrior Sheamus. Bringing the attitude. So tonight he is lighting up the city of Sacramento, California here tonight as the United States champion. And so it begins. Not exactly likable. And Sheamus is bragging to the fact that on a, his first pay-per-view night here in WWE, he beat John Cena and became WWE champion. And I was back at the TLC pay-per-view in 2009 in the tables matchup when Sheamus first arrived on the scene. Okay. Bringing the attitude. Sheamus says he's a winner. He always has been. And Sheamus says he would love nothing more to embarrass John Cena here tonight once again here on Friday Night SmackDown. And Sheamus is calling John Just Cena out well, as he wants okay. John Cena to come out here and accept his United States Championship matchup. Sheamus has been a dominant United States Champion over the past couple of months. No words. Excuse me, has been able to stop Sheamus. Bringing the attitude. Sheamus says he has nothing to lose. And that does it. But everything to gain if he beats John Cena here tonight. Sheamus says John Cena has to, to the end of tonight. Sheamus says he will get John, get rid of John Cena once and for all. And the United States champion, Sheamus the Celtic Warrior, is focused on ending the career of John Cena here tonight, even if he has to put his United States championship on the line. Will the United States championship be on the line, ladies and gentlemen? We're going to have to stay tuned. Now coming up next, that should be a dandy of a matchup as Chad Gable will go one-on-one -on -one with the charismatic enigma Jeff Hardy. For the first time ever, these two men will lock horns here on Friday Night SmackDown. And this set to be a good matchup between Gable and Jeff Hardy. Here comes the charismatic enigma, Jeff Hardy. Brace yourself for the charismatic enigma. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Cameron, North Carolina, weighing in at 225 pounds. Jeff Hardy with that zombie-like appearance to the ring, but he is very much alive, and he is feeling it here. As Hardy says, he has a wave of momentum. Brother Nero truly has done it all, and I think he sees it all too. He's got painted on eyes. For over 20 years, this man has walked the tightrope. He's almost ended his career on many occasions, but he's still looking. Chad Gable, big opportunity here tonight. There's Chad Gable back on the scenes here in SmackDown and looking to make the most of it here tonight in this matchup against the charismatic enigma Jeff Hardy. Minnesota native has scratched and clawed for everything he's earned in his life. 
represented the United States in the Olympics, former tag team champion on multiple occasions. Chad Gable is ready to do big things on the big stage. This is set to be a group match up here. Jeff Hardy is the charismatic enigma. And that special bond with the WWE Universe is what drives him. an elbow tied up here between Hardy and Gable. And, risk it at all in every match. and the official letting the these two rock it out here. Gable, and respect between these two men. Oh, it's there, but oh, what an elbow that was to Jeff Hardy by Chad Gable. Now Gable working down the arm of Jeff Hardy. And this is a big matchup for Chad Gable. He can get a victory over somebody like Jeff Hardy here tonight. Oh, get him back on the scenes here in SmackDown. Get him some more matches. As he said he's been overlooked over the past couple of months here in WWE. Oh, perhaps for a long, long time. And a drop kick there takes him down. And for Jeff Hardy, this is just an opportunity to keep patting up the victories until you can get a championship opportunity. And Jeff Hardy has been trying to all oh, get the WWE champion Drew McIntyre's attention. He had an opportunity. Oh, wait a minute. The official stepping in here. Oh, Jeff is still going to go for it. And Jeff Hardy, oh, takes him out. Jeff Hardy risking body and all to take out his opponent here tonight. As Chad Gable oh, sends Jeff back inside of the ring. Now Gable back inside of the ring, the former SmackDown Tag Team Champion and Raw Tag Team Champion. Gable, oh, certainly good in the Tag Team Division, too. And, oh, that could have had him a victory there. Chad Gable right back on the attack. Got the takedown there. Excellent move. For me, Olympian. Gable with a oh, snap suplex. Oh. Jeff with a counter there. But Gable right back at him. Off the ropes. And oh. Over the head. Belly to belly. Hurting a little here. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. Olympic worthy maneuvers from Gable. It's starting to come oh, together. Gable bringing it all together now. Oh, guy. and another suplex. And a throw there on Hardy. Chad Gable, oh, bringing a fight to Jeff Hardy here tonight. Oh, and a beautiful monkey flip. If I was Chad Gable, I'd be careful not to get too flamboyant too early. Oh, and a knee right to the face. Gets out of there in a hurry. Jeff rolling out. Oh, right back inside. Snapmare. Oh. Perfectly executed elbow there. Hardy has him. Oh, flatliner. Oh, an atomic drop there by the charismatic Enigma Hardy. Nice reversal by Gable. Chad Gable looking for another suplex throw. And again. And now Jeff Hardy finds himself in a tough spot. I was going to go for another one. Oh, cover. And a kick out this time. Hardy able to kick out before ref. Able to begin a count. Oh, trips him down the leg. No. came up big in that exchange. Oh, Hardy tossing his body right alongside. Jeff Hardy sees the opening. Oh, Hardy. Oh, what a DDT. Excellent DDT there by Jeff Hardy. Gable trying to stand in this matchup. Backdrop there. Hooks the leg. And a kick out. Way too early. Oh, took him too much time to feel the momentum. And he's going to feel this twist of fate right here. Hardy looking for the win. Cover one, two, and oh, Gable able to kick out of the twist of fate. I don't think his opponent was expecting that. Boom, right between the eyes. Oh. Oh, and in the corner now. Oh, and a boot right to the face. By the Olympian, Chad Gable on a German suplex. And Gable is on fire now. And Gable is feeding off the WWE Universe. 
Jeff Hardy, who is hurt now. Wait a minute. Arnie. Arm drag from the top rope. Could this be it? To put away Jeff. No, not enough. What an impressive showing this has been for Chad Gable here in this matchup tonight. Oh, elbow right back to Adam. Oh, and another one. Now is the time for Chad Gable to find a way to shift into that extra gear. Gable. And the instinct from Gable. Fighting him off. So quick. Oh, oh right to the arm. Russian leg sweep. Oh, and a drop right. kick hits there. Oh, but Jeff Hardy oh, fires right back with one. On oh, Jeff. Oh, a frog splash. Back inside of the ring. And Jeff trying to get back up to his feet. And he does right before Chad Gable. On a twist of fate once again. Hardy hits it. And oh, another kick out. Oh, Jeff. Springboard, swan time bomb. That's gonna do it. That's gonna do it right here. Oh, but look, great ring awareness of Chad Gable to grab the ropes and to stay into this matchup. As Jeff Hardy is in shock there. Jeff Hardy's on the attack. An innovative assault from Jeff Hardy, keeping the pressure on. And oh, from nice forearm right to the face. Uh oh, ankle pick. Goes out to the leg. Oh, spinning toe hole. That's gonna hurt. And Chad Gable going up to the top turnbuckle here. Gable feeling it. Gable, well, it, oh, moonsault from the top rope connects on a charismatic Enigma Hardy. Could this put it, be enough to put away Jeff? No. An impressive matchup this has been here tonight between Chad Gable and Jeff Hardy. Gable looking to put away the charismatic Enigma Jeff Hardy right here tonight. Into the turnbuckle, O'Connor roll. Oh, and a German suplex. Good night. One, two. But no, Jeff Hardy kicks out. Jeff Hardy kicks out at two. A near fall after near fall here in this matchup. This has been quite the matchup between these two men here on SmackDown. Between Hardy and, oh, Chad Gable. It's the Olympian. Looking to dig deep into his bag of tricks to put away Jeff. Oh. Um, Jeff Hardy's going to place Chad Gable up on the top rope. Hold on, guys. This isn't good. What is Jeff doing? Oh, Hardy. Oh. Oh, what a Harakurana. Harakurana from the top there rope. He goes. Jeff Hardy is now he's going to look for it here. He's trying to get End zone. Swan Tom Bomb connects on Gable. Hooks the leg. Two. Three. And Jeff Hardy wins. Jeff Hardy puts him away here tonight. What a matchup between these two men. Chad Gable and Jeff Hardy certainly... Chad Gable wants to extend his hand. Great sportsmanship by Chad Gable and Jeff Hardy. A well-fought matchup by Chad Gable, but it wasn't enough to put away Jeff Hardy, who keeps the momentum alive.
coming up next here on Friday Night Smackdown, we're going to see Lars Sullivan in return. As he did return last week and took out Big E. As he returns to in-ring action against Big E here tonight. As Big E wants some payback. Despite what Lars Sullivan did to him last week. As the Freak is back on Friday Night Guys, Smackdown. Here comes the brutality. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from the Rocky Mountains. This is a frightening in frame, scary individual right here. Lars Sullivan is not a man to be messed with and to be taken lightly. As we've seen the freak return last week to SmackDown when he self destructively beat the holy hell out of Big E after Big E's matchup with King Corbin. And King Corbin did the smart thing and got the hell out of Dodge and left Big E to be mangled by that freak right there, Lars Sullivan. Block out the sun itself. Imagine the size of this man. Well, not literally. That'd be the worst case scenario. This is going to be a collision between these two big men here tonight. WWE Universe, don't you dare be sour, clap for your longest reign tag champs and feel the power, it's a new day, yes it is, here comes the alpha male of the new day from Tampa, Florida, Big E, Big E was victorious last week over the King. Now tonight, he looks to get some revenge on a man who attacked him after his matchup, Lars Sullivan. And Big E said he is not afraid of no freak. Big E is a freak of his own. That's how Big E likes to prefer to himself. It's all about... Lars Sullivan destroys Lars Sullivan a Sullivan return to end ring action. Oh, and taken out the knee. By a freight train. Oh, he is frightening. The former Just whamming at the knee of Big E off the ropes. Big oh, a shot that was. And Lars Chris Sullivan manhandling Big E and I'm pounding away with those nasty strikes. Sugary cereal in the mouths of strangers as making an indelible mark in the annals of WWE. Oh. Just implying such a thing is absurd. Maybe you should try it. And the freak now is the in control of this matchup right here. Find that rush of adrenaline to push you forward. I am feeling a titanic shift roaring through this crowd right now. I think he's going to need the rest of the help. Oh, the new right day. Now. Oh, nice counter there. Right, Iris Whipson's Lars the Sullivan in the corner. Oh, oh now Biggie looking to hammer there. away. Oh, got the arms. Oh, trapped up and look face first right into the turnbuckle. Excellent moves there. Oh, Big E having to keep Lars Sullivan grounded here in this matchup. If he wants to be victorious. Lars Sullivan doing a great job of turning that around. Oh. Shoulder block over and oh. over in the corner. Look at those nasty shoulder blocks and the power of the freak Nar Lars Sullivan. Oh, has Big E up. And, oh, the suplex. That strong power right here. Oh. Exploiting the opening. Hey, Lars Sullivan grabbing him. Oh. Holding him off. Oh, and the knee right to the face. Shoulders down. One. Oh, we thought that knee might have knocked Lars Sullivan out cold. Oh. Nice counter right here. Oh, look at those knees right to the midsection. And that earthquake and slam.
Military on R. Sullivan. Oh, my goodness. The power of this man. It's old. It's just uncanny, to say the least. Oh. Lars in control of this matchup and in the corner, Big E, and oh, just flattening him. And the powerhouse of the New Day, meeting the powerhouse, the freak. Oh, what a power bomb. Could this do it right here? One. I know Big E easily kicking out of that one. Continuing to frustrate Lars Sullivan. I'll duck that one. And oh, what a a tackle right there. I've never seen Lars Sullivan drop like that before. And now Big E, oh! Blaming at him with a knee right to the face. Oh, and another shot right to the back. Back to back double axe handles. Now an over the head, belly to belly. Big E trying to get this crowd here in Sacramento. Behind him, back into this matchup. What else is new? Oh, has Lars up. And, oh, the freak just got dropped right on the ropes there. Shoulders down. One. And a kick out at one as Lars Sullivan able to stay in this. And somehow Lars Sullivan showing determination here. And oh, all that weight comes crashing down on Big E. Two. And oh, that almost is it. I thought Big E had this matchup one. Oh, now he has Lars Sullivan up. Uh-oh. Revenge in sight. There it is. Midnight. I mean, big ending there. Big E hits the big ending. And I'm like Lars Sullivan. Powers out of that one. As the freak stays in it. And oh, the backbreaker. Thrust right to the throat. Man can't breathe. The man can't fight. Oh, now Biggie up. Oh. oh, man. And look, continuing to hammer away. Stopping down. And Biggie manages to reverse out of Oh, Lawrence Sullivan counters that one. And right back to the knee. Oh, on oh, a slam. slam. Big E looking completely defeated right now. He won't quit. But can Big E better. even he stay in this matchup? How long? How much does he have? Oh, he gets out of the way that time. Get those massive hip flexors moving. Okay, Byron, leave the table. And, oh, look table. at the counter there. An athletic counter, to say the least, from Lars Sullivan. Now look, just, oh. Oh, we've seen with this Lars Sullivan. People end up getting hurt. Capable of, and oh my God, oh. Big E tossed to the outside. Oh, showing his focus onto that table. Lars Sullivan, oh. Oh, face first. With Big E tossing him back inside of the ring. And Lars Sullivan all right back to the knee again. Backbreaker. Oh. Top rope goes Lars Sullivan. Sullivan scaling the ropes. Oh! Indescribable carnage from Lars Sullivan. Things are really going his way now. I know Lars Sullivan has something in his sights. And it's looking like a freak accident for Big E. 
freak accident just like we saw last week. One, two, three. Lars Sullivan victorious. As the freak picks up the win. Lars Sullivan not done yet. Lars not finished. Oh, then not stomping away on Big E. Look at Lars Sullivan go to work stomping. Vicious stomps there on Big E by Lars Sullivan. No remorse by Lars Sullivan right there. Just stomping the holy hell out of Big E as the freak takes out Big E here tonight on SmackDown. Uh, coming up next, the world heavyweight champion, the ECW champion, Braun Strowman, goes one-on-one -on -one with the great liberator, Mr. Money in the Bank, Sami Zayn. We're going to find out who's going to win this matchup. Coming up next, this is going to be a good one. Heard all around the arena here tonight in Sacramento for the world heavyweight champion, the monster among men, Braun Strowman. Mr. Money in the Bank, Sami Zayn, was certainly not ready to go for this matchup. We see him earlier tonight interrupt the WWE Champion Drew McIntyre and tell Sami Zayn it's just a matter of time before he cashes in that Money in the Bank briefcase and becomes WWE Champion. I don't think Sami Zayn is looking forward to cashing in on Braun Strowman anytime soon. Braun Strowman versus Sami Zayn. Here we go. Sammy is never shy of oh, the monster among men. WWE Universe or his fellow superstars. Just rolling Sammy over Sami Zayn. It is time to put up oh, Sami Zayn. Oh! So the great liberator. Nor ask for forgiveness. He 
simply destroys. Going to forget about this matchup as quickly as possible. With Strowman all oh, already in control. Saxton, and sports entertainment has never oh, he's going to get these hands early. Like this from one human being. Oh, nice counter right there by Sammy. And oh, a drop kick. Almost bringing Strowman down to his feet. With no superstar willing to give an inch. The WWE Universe willing these superstars on. Pumping the adrenaline they so desperately oh, what the? need right oh, now. Oh, and Sami Zayn sending Strowman down to the outside. Guys, just oh, and a drop kick. Strowman, Strowman bouncing off that announce table. Oh, and another one. As Mr. Money in the bank. Run and hide. If that fails, you need to evade and strike when you get the chance. Oh, no. Sami Zayn. We often talk about worst case scenarios when it comes to Braun Strowman. Every scenario is worst case. Oh, and Sammy. Oh, being tossed. Braun Strowman, the world heavyweight champion. Loving his handiwork here in this matchup. Having his way with, oh, Sami Zayn here tonight. Sami Zayn reverses it. Sami Zayn with the reversal. Oh, off that is a Herakurana. Beautiful Herakurana by Sami Zayn. Oh. Uh-oh. Sammy now. Oh, looking to keep Braun Strowman grounded. Oh, and a monster among men. It's a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. Oh no. Oh, and Sammy Zayn. Yeah, he needs to make an adjustment here. Oh, Braun Strowman. Oh, look at Sammy. Oh, on the outside. Oh, Sammy's going to go for it again. Oh, he connects twice. Referee up to a count of four. Braun tossed back inside the ring. Braun Strowman on the top rope. This doesn't look good for Sammy. Oh, and Strowman. Sammy trying to escape Braun. Oh, Sammy Zayn is going to bring the fight to the He's monster among the men. Here. I don't know how wise this is. I don't know how wise. Oh, my goodness. Right against the barricade. What a power slam. Sammy Zayn playing possum. Nobody ever accused Sammy Zayn of holding back. Wait, what? Oh, wait a minute. Uh oh, I shot her. Wait a minute, the lights just went out. out. What I the hell is going on? Is not on my run oh, Thank wait a minute. It's Bray Wyatt. It's you, Bray Wyatt. That felt like an eternity to me. Braun Strowman's former never... leader, Bray Wyatt. And holy Sister Abigail! Sister Abigail to the monster among men. The eater of worlds. Just appeared here on SmackDown. A sister Abigail to Braun Strowman. Covered by Sami Zayn. Two. Three and Sami Zayn victorious. Mr. Money in the Bank. Sami Zayn wins here tonight. Thanks to. Thanks to Bray Wyatt. You know, Braun Strowman and Bray Wyatt has quite the history with one another. Former Wyatt family members. We just got a mini reunion. And the lights went out. And next thing you know, you see Bray Wyatt. Face to face with Braun Strowman, Sister Abigail, helping that man right there, Sami Zayn, chalk up the victory. As we're never going to be able to hear the end of this one, Sami Zayn is going to brag in for weeks on out about this win over Braun Strowman here tonight. Thanks to Bray Wyatt. Um, but up next, and look who's here, the king of blue suits, the game, Triple H, the SmackDown Joe manager, We'll have some things to say about the return of his brother-in-law at the Money in the Bank pay-per-view, which Triple H did not like that. And we're going to hear how Triple H certainly feels about it.
Triple H was never really in a good mood. I guess ego matters in this business. Calling his son, his brother-in-law, a piss ant and a waste of space to the WWE Universe, Shane McMahon. Not exactly likable. Well, okay. Triple H accusing Shane O'Mac of assaulting Mustafa Ali in his hotel room. And that's the reason why Shane McMahon took Mustafa Ali's place inside the men's Money in the Bank ladder matchup. I guess believing you can do something sometimes makes uh -oh. sense. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I was now? not expecting this. Who the hell was we expecting to hear Shane McMahon's music? Shane McMahon is here tonight. What is Shane O'Mac doing here? The former SmackDown general manager is in the house to confront his brother-in-law, the new SmackDown GM. And Triple H seems to be opening. Gotta like that attitude. That's one way to start. Shane McMahon says, let's cut to the chase. He simply didn't attack anybody in a hotel room. He said, I just went out and participated in the matchup no because he can do whatever he wants sure. when he wants. And not a damn thing Triple H or anybody can we do about see. it. And Triple H is acknowledging the fact that Shane McMahon shouldn't even be in the damn building. He was fired when he lost to his father at WrestleMania thanks to Triple H. Hard to finish anything around this place. Not feeling the love for that superstar. Shane McMahon says he's out here to challenge Triple H to a matchup at Extreme Rules. Well, okay. As he wants to fight his brother-in-law one-on-one, man-to-man, face-to-face. Triple H says he's not going to give him the satisfaction. He is not giving him the opportunity at Extreme Rules to face him. And Triple H says he's just trying to use this to gain power back into the WWE. Like that power that he has already lost. Pride comes before the fall. Better watch it. And Shane McMahon says he does not want to be in control of WWE. He does not want to be GM SmackDown. He just wants to beat the living shit out of Triple H in front of the sold out crowd at Extreme Rules in San Francisco, California, a week from Sunday. Triple H says Shane McMahon is not even in his league. And besides, the last time those two men met, it was Triple H who came out on top inside of a Hell in a Cell matchup with a Open suit on. There. Okay. And Shane McMahon says you can even drag my deadbeat father into this matchup. As he says, it can be a two-on-one handicap matchup at Extreme Rules. Uh-oh. Somebody seems a little cocky. And you know, Shane McMahon is responsible for his father being stunned three weeks in a row at the hands of Stone Cold Steve Austin, the Koji on Monday Night Raw. Shane McMahon giving Stone Cold that, that position. Boiling, and that does it. Triple H telling Shane he's lucky he's not in the mood to kick the living crap out of him right now.
and Triple H declining Shane McMahon's offer for a matchup at Extreme Rules a week from Sunday. Triple H telling Shane McMahon as of right now, he is far good at retired and he does not look forward to beating Shane McMahon once again. So I wonder what's next for Shane McMahon now. Where will Shane O'Mac go from here? But up next, we know King Corbin is in action against our WWE champion, Drew McIntyre. And we just received word that John Cena will face Sheamus for the United States Championship and our main event here tonight on SmackDown. But up next, King Corbin versus Drew McIntyre here on Friday Night SmackDown. Stay with us. There's our WWE Champion, the Scottish Psychopath, Drew McIntyre. The following contest is scheduled fighting WWE Champion has been. The McIntyre is just a week from Sunday and still doesn't have a challenger for that championship around his waist. McIntyre holds dearly to that WWE Championship. Oh. Corey, might we see a different game plan from the champ here tonight? You mean because it's a non-title match? I don't think so, Cole. I'm willing to bet he's going to fight his fight here tonight. Up. This is set to be, as Drew McIntyre said it, he owes King Corbin a Claymore kick to the face after a few months back when Corbin defeated Drew McIntyre. Corbin looking to make it 2-0 against the WWE Championship and perhaps earn his own opportunity at the WWE Championship at Extreme Rules. set to be a good one right here between Corbin and McIntyre. Drew McIntyre. 
McIntyre has proven to be one of the most... Oh, and McIntyre waiting right on him. WWE rank. Small wonder they call him a Terminator. Oh. And Baron Corbin Look at oh. Corbin in the Nothing corner now, fighting off those headbutts. Say what you will, Saxton. Corbin has a plan. And Under the corner the here. Of days. Got those shots on right to the back. Oh, Another one right to the midsection. Oh, that could have been it right there, but a kick out. And the King now in control. Oh, putting the knee right to the back of the neck. McIntyre rolls out. Oh, and what those chops right there. Taking down Corbin with a snap mirror and a kick right to the back. Making sure he keeps Drew McIntyre grounded as King Corbin. Knee right to the midsection. Oh, that's Drew McIntyre up and oh, brings Drew McIntyre down hard with a slam. And Corbin going to continue to showboat in this crowd. And the WWE Champion trying to get his wits back into this matchup with a knee right to the midsection on a second one. Oh, off the ropes. And now the Russian leg sweep right in the middle of the ring. Shoulders down, cover. And a kick out. McIntyre's still in this. Whoa, McIntyre able to McIntyre gets out of the way. Oh, delivers a clothesline of his own. Oh, flatliner. Scott is psychopath going up to the top rope. Looking on something here, Corbin. And oh, the chop. Devastating move there. And Corbin in trouble now. Look at the Kimura lock locked in. A Kimura locked in. Oh, and Corbin able to escape there. Off the ropes. And look at the power there. Oh, and a spine buster. Bringing down Drew McIntyre. And a knee right to the back. And there's the reversal from Drew McIntyre. Just digging in there. Got a good grip. Oh. Oh, it's McIntyre turning the tables. And oh, and Drew McIntyre with a boot right to the this face. You have to wonder if these superstars can keep up this pace. They're certainly being taken into the deep waters now. Oh. The back of his head right there. Oh, has him up. And just tosses all King Corbin that time. Beautiful power by Drew McIntyre, the WWE Champion. Has him up. Oh, wipes him out face first. McIntyre hooks the leg. And a kick out. Oh. Oh, and a glass lows kiss there by Drew McIntyre. Shoulders down, legs hooked. Two and King Corbin wipes out of it. More than that to keep him down. And oh. the reversal from Drew McIntyre. Gotta give credit where credit is due. Corbin able to stay in this matchup. But how long? Oh, and a power driver. We got a cover. Dumping him right on his damn head. Cover right about a ref. And a kick out at one. Very nice. Oh, and an elbow right to the face. Oh, and an uppercut. Man can't breathe, the man can't fight. What a raucous crowd here tonight. There it is. A bear hug locked in. And how much can Drew McIntyre withstand? Wow, looked to me like he had it locked in pretty good. Oh. I guess not. Oh, and a chop right to the chest. Drew McIntyre spots the opening. McIntyre has him up again, and oh! Face first there. Oh, an elbow right to the face. And Corbin counters that one. Oh, and a clothesline again. Stomping away on the midsection. Sharp one right to the 
cheekbone. Whoa, McIntyre. Oh, McIntyre escaping that one. Oh, end of days. End of days. Signed, sealed, and delivered. That's one of those moves where you check your extremities upon impact. Baron Corbin is measuring. Here we go again. And oh, another end of days. A second one. One. Two. Oh, a kick out. WWE Universe has come alive in this one. They are up and they are vocal. A lot of energy in the room. McIntyre kicked out of two end of days. Oh, it's oh. McIntyre turning the tables. Oh, another kiss. Glaslow's kiss. Across the shoulders and. Oh, and a gut buster. Oh, and the knee right to the face. Oh, McIntyre. Finding his way back into this matchup. Thrust right to the throat. Man can't breathe. Oh, Drew McIntyre sending him to the outside. What is the WWE champion looking for here? Oh, the McIntyre. Gonna look to take flight. Oh, wiping him out. Drew McIntyre. Just floor. certainly went there with that move. Oh, McIntyre says he owed him a Claymore kick. One, two, three. Bam! What a Claymore kick. McIntyre hooks the leg. One, two, three. And that's all she wrote. Drew McIntyre picks up a win. The WWE Champion Vanquish. Baron Corbin here tonight. Oh, wait a minute. Look who it is. The Tribal Chief. Look who it is. The Tribal Chief, Roman Reigns. What the hell is Reigns doing out here? Reigns has McIntyre up. Niagara Fall. Oh, Drew McIntyre being taken out by Roman Reigns. What the hell is the big dog doing out here? And the Tribal Chief now choking out. Drew McIntyre, as he continues his assault on the WWE Champion. Are we looking at Drew McIntyre's next opponent for the WWE Champion? As Reigns is out here, and once again, setting up for the Niagara Falls driver, as he picks apart Drew McIntyre here tonight on SmackDown. Roman Reigns has not let up on his attack on a Drew McIntyre here tonight. Oh, has him up, and the WWE Champion is in no condition to fight back here after that matchup. A nasty Samoa drop by Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns has no business being out here. The former WWE champion making it clear he is coming for McIntyre's WWE title. Oh man, that'll be a good one. We're going to need some help out here for Drew McIntyre after that beatdown. Oh, but up next, the WWE United States Championship is on the line as John Cena has accepted Sheamus' challenge. Sheamus laid it down earlier tonight. Cena accepted. Our main event is coming up next. Cena versus Sheamus. Can John Cena become a six-time United States Champion? We'll find that out coming up next here on Friday Night SmackDown.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the United States Championship. There's the doctor of Thugonomics, John Cena, who made his return to SmackDown in ring action last week when he took on Sami Zayn. But after the matchup, he was beaten down mercifully at the hands of our United States Champion Sheamus. Now John Cena has a chance to take Sheamus United States Championship away from him with some sweet, sweet revenge. Can Cena get it done here in this matchup? Sheamus, the United States champion. A pint and a fight is a good Sheamus night. Sheamus will cave your chest in with the beats of the Bowerin or knock your head clean off with a broke kick. Sheamus is only one of two men to win Money in the Bank, King of the Ring, and the Royal Rumble. Introducing the champ. United States Championship matchup here. This right here is a championship that gained a lot of prestige. Oh, Cena. Five-time yeah, United I mean, States champion looking to make it six. Here tonight, the Celtic Warrior Shame is looking to end Cena's career. Look how Cena's coming out of this matchup. Just swinging on Sheamus. Remember back over, all over a decade ago, Sheamus took the WWE Championship away from John Cena. In the tables matchup now, Cena's looking to take the United States Championship away from Sheamus here on our main event on Friday Night SmackDown. Oh, and a suplex from the top. Locks in the gut wrench. And oh, what a nice gut wrench suplex by Sheamus. And now the United States champion, the Celtic Warrior, hammering away on John Cena. Whoa, and oh, the stomach. Just stomping away on Cena. The challenger, not allowing him to get back into this matchup. Oh, over the head with a suplex there. John, oh, fighting right back. And a clothesline. What's it going to take for John Cena to come out on top here? Cena with a wicked clothesline there, the laid out Sheamus and fires back with another one. Will lead him to another win. Cena being sent, oh, ribcage first right against the barricade. And no, 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 all of that head belly to belly right on the floor. And the United States champion Sheamus taking in control of this matchup once again. And a shoulder tackle right on the outside. All right, Cena turning tides John around Cena here in this matchup. Right John Cena now has Sheamus up. Oh, and like a long dart goes Sheamus right against the ring post. 
Referee up to a counter for championship advantage. I think Cena knows the championship advantage. Is that state here tonight? There's oh! John Cena with another clothesline. As he brings the pain to Sheamus here in this matchup. Oh, referee being knocked down. Missed that time. Cena off the ropes and a knee right to the back. Aggressive knee right to the back. Oh, and a clothesline. And just like that, Sheamus is back in control. Oh, this matchup. That's going to hurt. And the knee right to the back. That'll slow John Cena down a step or two. Oh, belly to belly. Suplex. Can big match John get back into this matchup? United States Championship is on the line. Kicks directly to the chest. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? And a kick out by Cena. And a kick out he by Cena. Out there, Cole. And he's out of there in a nick of time. Oh, wait, turning around. Up. Oh, Cena. right on the floor. From Cena. John Cena laying Sheamus down hard with that move. And look at the quickness by oh. Cena. Some shots right there, rattling Sheamus Brain. Oh, ducks that one. Cena went for a clothesline. Sheamus ducked. Looks like nobody's and at the power of Cena. Oh. Cena now looking at it. Five knuckle shuffle. Could we see it here? Five knuckle shuffle. John Cena with the Celtic Warrior, Sheamus up. Attitude adjustment. Sheamus is down. One, two. And oh, the Celtic Warrior, Sheamus kicks out. Sheamus kicks out of the AA. Yeah, he's got to find a way out of that corner. Cena being placed up on the top row backwards now. Uh oh, I'm afraid to think oh. next. John Cena with a counter there. Right Cena from the top rope. Oh, the leg drop by John Cena. Beautiful leg drop. One, two, and now Sheamus able to kick out. I thought that was it. We could have saw a new United States champion crowned. Oh. Sheamus now continuing to throw down. Oh, it's Cena here in this matchup. Uh-oh. This is not going to be good. Oh, backbreaker. And another one. Let's get a, a, a trifecta here. Oh, and a third backbreaker. Sheamus dragging Cena over. Cover right here to retain the U.S. championship. No. Cena's back in it. John Cena's back up. Uh-oh. John Cena back in it to show the tackle. Ducks that one. Oh, wait a minute. Cena. Five knuckle shuffle. Nope. Gonna turn things around and look for the... Oh, Sheamus gets out of the way just in the nick of time. Oh! And Cena, gonna think about it. He's gonna lock in the STFU on the outside. STF on the outside. Cena cannot win. This is not false count anywhere, but this is a good strategy by John Cena to weaken out Sheamus here. 
Sheamus tapped. Oh, the match is not over. Our oh, referee up to a count of three. Oh, Cena is going to take out Sheamus for good here tonight. Has him up on his shoulders. AA, AA through the announce table. An attitude adjustment right through the announce table. And we're going to crown the new United States champion. Attitude adjustment through the announce table. And Sheamus somehow kicks out. Sheamus kicks out. Oh, Cena still looking to hammer away on Sheamus. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten on Cena. Still dishing out punishment to Sheamus here in this matchup. I'll lift Sheamus up. Suplex. Oh. Now Seamus making him pay. Hold on, guys. This is Oh, Cena fought him off that time. And always oh, Seamus knee right to the midsection there. United States champion now. Oh, what another knee. This is knee right to the jaw. And Sheamus, oh, what a brome kick. Sheamus with the brome. Nasty brome kick by Sheamus. One, two. Now Cena got his shoulder up. Cena just got the shoulder up. Just in the nick of time. Right oh. Big match. John is still in it. Look at the power from Cena. Oh, and Cena. Oh, wipes him out there. No, no. Oh, and a belly to belly. What's he looking to do here? Oh, STF. STF locked in by Cena. Cena with the STF locked in. Cena's made so many superstars tap. I remember the game, Triple H at WrestleMania 22. No, but Sheamus is going to fight out of it. Sheamus fights out. And Sheamus, oh, holding on here in this matchup. And a kick out by Cena. Cena has the pride of a champion, and he always finds a way to dig deep. John Cena with a nice reversal. Oh, and a kick to the gut. Cena has him up in a power bomb position. Oh, he places Sheamus up on the top rope. I'm afraid to think what's gonna happen next. Oh. Up on the top rope. Cena looking for something here on the top rope. This could go south in a hurry. Here we go. Suplex, oh! Could this do it right here? Casino won the United States champion for a sixth time. Oh! That was damn near it. Always finding that deepest ounce of willpower, that final drop of fuel in the reserve. Oh, Seamus misses the knee. Cena, oh, right back at him with a headbutt. Elbow right to the head. Hey, hey, again. Cena hits the AA. One, two. Sheamus, all. Oh. Sheamus staying alive. Sheamus not letting that United States Championship go that easily. Sheamus willing to do whatever it takes to retain his United States title. Oh. John Cena is in shock now to do whatever he takes to win this matchup. 
Wait a minute. Oh, a springboard stunner. A springboard stunner by Cena. And now Sheamus kicks out again. Sheamus kicks out yet again. Oh, some more knees right there. Wicked body shot. Oh no. Submission hole locked in. Cena. Cena's in trouble. And Cena oh, John Cena could be finished here. But no. Oh, Cena looking for a small package. Looking for a win. One. Two. Oh. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. His opponent included. Five knuckle shuffle. Cena's gonna go for the end in here. Why not? Kick out. Oh. You can see the frustration starting to build. Wow. I thought for sure that was it. Oh, foot just stomping down. John Cena. Heavy. Oh. For the Looking for whatever to put away Sheamus. No, but the Celtic yeah, Warrior so still in it. And he's not done yet. Cena counters it. Cena, oh. Nice reversal. Not again. One of these competitors is eventually going to have to gain the upper hand. Oh. A slam there by Sheamus. Oh. Cena turning the tables. He just punched him in the chest. A quick reversal by Sheamus. And a clothesline. Oh, and Cena just golf Sheamus. And Sheamus slips out of harm's way. Sheamus back inside of the ring. Cena, head scissors, touch your toes. Oh, cover. One, two. Oh, that almost is it. That would have been the end. Interesting decision there. Kick to the gut. Oh, the Celtic Warrior. Cena, oh, went for a shoulder tackle, but I don't know who. And it's reversed. Paying for that mistake. Cena, oh, missed that time. Almost hit the official. Oh, what impact. The champion into the cover. Near fall. Oh, and John Cena. Still able to kick out. Incoming. And over the top rope and down to the outside he goes. Exiting the ring. Very interesting game. You see the frustration built on Sheamus' face. Oh, another shoulder tackle. Oh. I'll see him turning things around, tossing them inside of the ring. Seen it. Oh, missed that time. Sheamus, oh, gets hit with a shoulder tackle. John Cena looking to close this thing out. Leg is trapped. There it is. STF. Oh, Cena has the STF. You know, that's not enough to put away Sheamus. I don't know why. It's doubtful he would have ever gotten out of that. John Cena. Thinking down deep. Oh, it's a... Oh, way to put away Sheamus here tonight. Sheamus, oh! Yet another counter. Has his way. And Cena caught him. Attitude adjustment. An attitude adjustment. One, two, three. John Cena's a six-time United States champion. John Cena is our new champion. John Cena has won the United States Championship. 
for a sixth time. There it is, John Cena is the new United States Champion. Big Mac John prevail once again here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Cena defeats Sheamus to win the United States Championship for a sixth time. Oh my goodness, so you know what this means. You may see more open challenges back. New opportunity, fresh faces. John Cena is once again United States Champion. Thank you all for watching Friday Night Smackdown. I'll see you guys next time. Be sure to like and subscribe. Have a great night, everybody. Peace.